Greetings, YouTube. It's I, Leeway from Twisted Shimura. And some of you may be wondering, where the heck are the videos? It's been three weeks since the last video, and uh, a lot of factors have contributed to uh, the lack of videos. One of them has been, I have been very sick for the past week now. And that's one factor. Another factor is, um, I have been working a lot since the last video. Because, you know, I gotta work to survive. <laughs> uh, what else is there? Uh, a lot of technical difficulties have been occurring with us lately. You know, some of you may be wondering, hey, when's the next, you know, group gameplay thing, you know, with, like, Dying Light, the following, and Dead Island Riptide. Um, I don't know when the next video like that's going to be even considered. I'm current, well, me so far has been working on Resident Evil 7 videos right now. And next is hopefully get back onto Until Dawn soon. So I would like to finish Until Dawn. It's a very good game. Enjoy that game immensely. I love the uh, butterfly effect of the story. You know, one choice could have basically change the entire gameplay. Uh, another thing is sadly that uh, if y'all haven't noticed, uh, me and the gang haven't really been getting along lately. We don't know why that isn't exactly. We've just been fighting a lot off off camera. We'll we'll be playing a game together, and all of a sudden we'll be arguing with each other, wanting at each other's throats. We don't really know what is going on there, so we're hopefully hoping we can resolve that issue. Nothing too but nothing too major. It's just you know. It's kind of hard to record a gameplay session together when all of a sudden we start to argue with each other. It's like, that's not good. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. But uh, don't worry, more videos will be released soon in the near future. Hopefully by the end of the... Hopefully by the end of this week, another video will be uploaded. Besides this one. <laughs> Um, oh yes, uh, we've just found out that Capcom is releasing, well, re-releasing Resident Evil Revelations, the first game, for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and for the Nintendo Switch, which is great. It's a good game. I would love to play this game on new-gen consoles, because me and my friends, mainly Deus, because me and Deus are huge Resident Evil fans. I mean, we are... We're fangirls of the series, I guess you could say. <laughs> Even the movies. The movies are very good, despite what some other people say. But uh, me and Deus are feeling like Capcom is avoiding one game that me and Deus want immensely to be released for the new consoles, and that's uh, a, re a remaster or an HD or all DLC included of Resident Evil Operation Raccoon City, which was released back in uh, 2012 with a partner company. I think it was called... <laughs> uh, I think it was called Slant 6 Games, if I remember correctly. I have no idea. But I think that's one of the reasons why the game hasn't been released, is because uh, Slant 6 Games has been... Well, I think they've, they've, been de they've been out of business since... God knows, uh, I think since 2013, actually. Yeah, 2013. So I'm guessing it's because they have some, I guess, somewhere in the legal papers, they still have some rights to certain elements of Operation Raccoon City. And since, you know, they're out of business, it's there's no way to get it ported over to the new gen consoles. Me and Davis would love it, love to see it. Because we would love to play the Spec Op campaign, because we've never played it, because when the game was first released and we were still kids, well, not really kids, but younger, <laughs> yeah, we were poor as, we were poor back then, so we really couldn't afford the Spec Op campaign. So if anyone watches this, please help us get the support and votes we need to get it ported over to the next-gen consoles, if it's even possible. Uh, this is Leroy, and I'm signing off. See you guys in the next video and so on.